chicken Roman noodles? The chicken Roman noodles? Uh, honey, there ain't no way in hell that you're gonna tell me to put on a mask, all right? Please don't tell me that you're buying into that propaganda from the leftists, cause it ain't true. There's a 99.6% survival rate. I just wanna get back to my regular life. It's the store policy? Well, darling, you just lost a valued customer. See you later. Um, mom, why did they make me stay home if I tested positive? Even you always tell me to try to be positive, not negative. Yeah, you do actually. You can't even take a deep breath, mom. Look, that's all I can do actually. My throat feels so spicy, mom. Yeah, it's really spicy. It burns. I don't think I can take my medicine or eat vegetables. Yeah, no. Uh, yeah, mom, you're probably gonna have to carry me everywhere. My legs hurt so bad, actually. Yeah, they do. I think I need my vitamins. I don't really feel very good. Like, why do I even have to stay home for 10 days? Can't you just give me medicine and take it out of me? As long as you don't have to go to the doctor, I'll be fine. The doctor makes me feel worse. Do I have to get a shot since I don't feel good? Because I can feel better if I need to get a shot. Do my homework for me at least. My brain doesn't work because it's sick. I can't do an hour of activity outside today, Mom. No, my legs aren't working. Oh, come in, sweetie. Hi, Miss Sarah. Hi, Tatiana. What seems to be the issue, sweetie? I think my boyfriend's cheating on me. Oh my goodness, how do, you, how do you know? There's a number that's not even freaking safe in his phone that he keeps texting. Oh my gosh, sweetie, it's fine. Don't cry, don't cry. It's fine. We're gonna, we're gonna work this out. I'm sure it'll be all okay. Come in. You texting me? She knows. Ladies and gentlemen, I am extremely saddened to have to interrupt your recess, but I have a crucial announcement. As I said before, this water bottle is extremely important to me. Understand? And I also am a professional detective, so I use my detective skills to find fingerprints on this water bottle. Someone touched this water bottle and I drew the fingerprints 100% accurately on this piece of paper. And I will look at every single finger in this entire school until I find out who touched my water bottle. Frankly, this is illegal. It's illegal. Lydia, Antonio, stop passing notes. Are you bleeping too? <gasps> Who am I? I just said it. Bad. You literally said bleep. I knew I shouldn't have started tutoring Jessica. She's a bad, bad influence on me. I'm so sorry, Jess, to think we were almost at addition. <laughs> well, I guess I'm going to expel myself before Principal Merkin can. Goodbye, class. Goodbye, Piper, and your weird, weird writing style. Why do you hold the pets like this? Like, we, we can tell. Goodbye, Michelle, and your natural deodorant. When people are coughing around you, we're actually covering up our gag. You smell. Yeah, it was super weird. Hold on. Wait, hold on, guys. I forgot something over here. Oh, my God, y'all. Did you guys hear that? I think that was from the kitchen. I don't know what that was. Guys, hold on. Let me go check with the kitchen. Why are you looking at me, bruv? Look the other way. Are you a snake or something? You're making it so big. Can you look the other way? You're so moist, bruv. Yo, yo. Has he done the register? He has. Oh. Safe, 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 safe. Yeah? So I've got nothing in my mouth. You're just accusing me now. So that was my book. That was that, that was the noise of my book. Yeah. So I'm not opening my mouth. Who are you for me to be opening my mouth for you? I'll show you one second. Uh, you see, there's nothing in my mouth. You see, that's an embarrassment. You're actually an embarrassment. And then that's embarrassing. He accused me and he's wrong. So I wasn't late. I wasn't like, you called my name at the register and I said, hey, and you didn't listen. You're clearly deaf. That's not my problem. Next time use your ears on you a teacher like... <laughs> Welcome to my live stream. I look so good today. Like y'all can never. Like y'all are like ugly. I'm sorry y'all are ugly, but look at me. Like I'm so pretty. Oh my God. Why isn't there more people on? I'm like basically famous and I'm the prettiest and most popular girl in the school. Why isn't there more people on? They're fake anyway. 
And if my friends don't join this live stream, I'm dropping them. <laughs> anyway, my mom just got a Bentley today. I know, only a Bentley. She's making us seem like we're poor or something. Okay. Yeah. Y'all wish you were me. Excuse me, are you chewing gum? Hold on a second. Spit it out. Oh no, no, no. Did you just put another gum in your mouth when I was walking away? Yeah, you did. Yeah, spit it out. I said spit it out. Spit it out. Spit it out. Spit it out. You are still chewing. Oh no. <laughs> so? What's the occasion? Uh, nothing really. Just a friend sleepover with some new girls. A sleepover? Yeah. You, you, you came to the salon to get a hundred dollar hairdo for a sleepover? <laughs> They're popular girls, so I just, I don't know. I'm just nervous. Are you boys going to be there? <laughs> I don't know. Probably. So what are you looking to get? Um, curls. Curls? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god. I'm gonna put some of this hair serum in. So, do you have a boyfriend? No. Oh my god, how's school? Not very good. What the fuck? Why? <laughs> oh my god, we're such rebels. Like, we're actually sitting at the back of the bus. Can we move? Just because you're in year 12 doesn't mean you're at the top of the school. I was actually in year 6 last year and I was at the top of the school then. So, like, you know, we've both ruled schools before. I don't think you get to tell me where I can sit. Okay, yeah, I'll move. <laughs> oh, good. Get in before the teacher comes. I'm going to take a photo booth photo, okay? <laughs> We're so quick. <gasps> oh, my God. The teacher's, like, literally so annoying. Like, it's just the rules are so stupid. Like, stuff it up. Put my hair. Oh, my God. I don't want to get a detention. We literally get so much homework. It's ridiculous. I don't know what the year 12s are talking about. Like, I'm sure your VCE exams are hard, but like the homework the teachers give us is just ridiculous. It's not okay. Guys, I know that the year 12s are like driving, but it doesn't make them better than us. Like I'm gonna go sit in their area. <laughs> Right, good morning ladies. We are already five minutes late for my lesson. Um, I'm not sure why it took you so long to get here from science. But quick sticks, let's get dressed. We need shin pads on today, okay? We're doing hockey, yay! What do you mean you haven't got your kit? Right, Emily, this is the second time you've forgotten your kit in a fortnight, isn't it? It's not good enough, okay? You know you need sports kit for PE. You know you have PE on a Tuesday. You're year nine now. Who's your form teacher? Right, come on, come on. Can we stop spraying spray deodorant, please? Carly has asthma. You know this, girls. Ladies, what are we still doing in the changing rooms? Everyone else is outside. No, you don't need to wait for her. She's more than capable of getting dressed on her own. Out we go, please. Come on. Son, you are a mistake. <coughs> Michael, no. <coughs> Sweetie, you're not a mistake. Michael, <laughs> your mother and I um, just couldn't brush over our fundamental differences. What I'm saying is, son, you're going to need to. <coughs> I miss my amazing and kind friends. So here I am. Oh, hey, Emma. Emma is so pretty and she's so perfect. I love her so much. You're, you are too, I guess. Oh, thank, thank you. Um, anyway, I've just been reading and I'm actually gonna go shopping later today. So that's fun. 
Oh, hey, Rose. Rose is on my soccer team. She's so talented. She's like the best player. You're okay. Okay, you know what, guys? I'm so sick of y'all being so fake. All I do is compliment you and be nice to you, and you guys are so rude. I'm done with it. You aren't even that talented or pretty. I'm just a kind person. We are friends anymore. I found this really funny for some reason. Hey, co-worker. I have a quick question for you. Did you get invited to Mark's party on Friday? You did. So, is everyone going? Ah. I think my invitation was lost. Maybe I haven't received it. So, I don't know, maybe you could ask Mark for me. about that. Sorry, that's my desk hamster, Michael. He was making a nest for himself. Could you ask Mark for an invitation from me? Excuse me, I couldn't help but notice that um, you're wearing headphones and that led me to believe that you were listening to music. And you do know that one of the rules in the teacher's classroom is that you should be listening to appropriate music, correct? So um, I need you to show me what music you're listening to just to make sure that it's appropriate. You're listening to a song called WAP? I've never heard of that song, so could you kindly unplug your earplugs and let me have a listen? Okay, thank you. Hmm? <gasps> no, turn that off right now. Turn that off. Turn that off. Turn that off. What is wrong with you? That is so inappropriate. You are a terrible person. I can't believe you would play that in the teacher's classroom. I am ashamed and disappointed in you. Unbelievable. Excuse me, miss. Excuse me. They're listening to a really, really inappropriate song. I heard one second of it, and I was horrified by the amount of inappropriateness I was in it. You need to take away their phone right now, miss. I need to go wash my ears out. Hi, everybody. Welcome back to class. Now, bear with me. I'm not very good at working this Zoom stuff, but we're just going to do some icebreakers today. So say your name and a cool fun fact about yourself. Hi, guys. I'm Erica. I'm never going to be looking at the camera. I'm just going to look off to the side because I'm going to be on my phone for the entire class. Hey, I'm Miranda. I kind of agree with that one, except I will shamelessly be on my phone the entire time. I don't care. Hey, guys. I'm Matt. Uh, I thought online classes were going to be really easy. <laughs> it turns out I don't have enough willpower to open my laptop on my own. I'm Becky, so just piggybacking off of Matt here. Uh, I'm already failing three classes, and it's been two weeks, so... I don't really feel anything anymore. I don't know if I'm upset about it or if I expected it. Guys, I'm Ben. This is the first and only time you'll ever see me with my camera on. Oh, is it my turn to speak? Sorry, I didn't notice. Um, I'm definitely gonna be posing at all moments just in case you guys are taking pictures of me uh, because I am a narcissist. Hi, I'm Caitlin. I've never used Zoom before and I don't remember what class this is. Um... Hello. Do you wanna start with the first question then? This question here, yeah? Cool. If x equals 6, find the equation of the... Yo, I don't know how to do that. Do you get the question? Oh, well, if neither of us get it, I don't really know what to do. I might go ask Daniel because he knows a lot about this topic, so I'll be back in like one minute. Oh, she's so boring. No, I am though. That's the thing. I'm literally, I'm being so nice to her, yet she just doesn't say anything. It's literally infuriating. <sighs> yeah, he says he doesn't know. Should we just ask Mr. Evanson or... Okay, so we don't get it. Oh, oh my god. Plus my drive to do the best in everything I do. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Mister, I think I think Vanessa was distracting me with her regular street clothes. I don't think Hot Topic is her uniform. <sighs> Vanessa, oh. meet me in my office now. Snitches get itches. Don't you mean... Crap! 